Nice good to hear Demon Demon dot com. Just done a search for holiday homes in Kent. It's not a niche. It's anything to do with me anymore. Um, but I thought I'd have a look. And we're showing uh, something called just move the mic. Um, domain crowding, which has got to be an error that Google are currently doing. Right. So that's this is a competitive term. People will search for that term because they want to rent a holiday home in Kent. So you'd expect. 90% of the top 100 results to be commercial in nature and yet look at the results check out the main domain here freedomholidayhomes.co.uk 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 freedom holiday and we keep going down I'll stop every page one two three we've got four there five six seven eight nine ten eleven we go for the privacy policy right this that's ranking above all other sites that deal with holiday homes in Kent and there are many so one site Google considers that one site's privacy policy and one site's about us page is better value to uh, the searcher than alternatives it would rather give and it's got I think it's 23 it just goes on and on look still there we go we've got the first one here it becomes holiday lettings have a look at holiday lettings in Kent uh, there we are look I mean that it is overtly commercial but it's got plenty of information how is that not more useful than this other sites about us page contact us page privacy policy page really Google you give 23 um, results to the same domain including this which is complete dribble which interests nobody at all and the about us page and the contact page and the, just privacy policy I bet these people are absolutely raking it in now. It's a time of year where um, the people who make money on this uh, over the last few months since this has been going on will be absolutely raking in the cash and thinking, look, our com competition isn't even on the top three pages anymore. We've wiped them out. Our contact page is better than the next best, and it's not. Google, if you really think this is you're doing good here, you need to go and take a long, cold bath and sort yourself out. Now, am I saying this because I'm losing? No, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. In fact, I'm gaining from it. Here is the phrase: "Ultimate Demon Discount." Number one is a post within Warrior Forum, and now sometimes I'm above that, sometimes I'm below it. I, I, it would be better for this example if I was above it today, but it make, makes not a lot of difference because I've noticed not many people like to buy from forums; they'd rather buy from proper websites rather than rather than just an individual post on a forum. Anyway, <clears throat> here it is: DemonDemon.com, and if you go down. I think I'm the next because as you probably know I, I add to my site a lot I'm about the next 17 results are all me so I'm not complaining this is this isn't something that's bitching me about and I've got the same on my moped sites and my uh, I've got the same on some other niches I do uh, which I won't talk about here because most of you don't know about them um, but it's wrong I mean I shouldn't be in that position but you know this well it's just it's just nonsense um, what I believe is the situation is that Google gives it is assigning authority to the root domain and then some of that authority filters down to the individual URLs below that root domain and what I think is happening is it's giving each individual URL too much authority for any particular word or phrase so that if the main root page domain name has too much it's totally skewing the results for even the most asinine and worthless page or post beneath it. So freedomholidays.co.uk is probably the premium uh, authority domain for the niche or for the keyword holiday homes in Kent. Um, but it's still not acceptable that um, it's giving all this authority to the sub pages underneath it until you, you have to get to, I don't know where you get down to here. It's incorrect and it needs sorting out. Anyway, scritty at demondemon.com, signing off.